thank you, Gempo. Uh, now uh, I call the comrade uh, Zeno Safari to introduce himself. Hello, everyone. Good afternoon. I'm Zainal Bin Sapari. I am 46 years old, uh, married with uh, six children. I do hope I could inspire young couples like uh, Peling to have many children as well. I come from a family with a humble uh, background. Uh, my father held uh, three jobs and my mother had to work as well to support the uh, family. Uh, despite uh, my parents being uh, low-wage uh, workers, uh, we were still happy and uh, grateful with what uh, we had then. During our growing up years, uh, we stayed in the workers' quarters provided by the expatriate family my parents were working for. Uh, this helped my family a lot because our utilities were fully paid for by the expatriate uh, family. Uh, my, family, my family moved out uh, to a three-room flat in Bedok North when I was uh, 14 years old. I'm the only one in the family to uh, made it to university with the help of the government uh, special Malay bursary. My parents' tenacity and perseverance to provide education for myself and my siblings impacted my outlook on life tremendously and I see the importance of education as a social uh, leveler. Upon graduating from NUS in 1990, I pursued a teaching career because I really wanted to make a difference in the life of the young children. I taught in Tampines Secondary School for uh, 10 years, and one of the most valuable lessons has been taught by my students, where they taught me that as teachers, where they taught me as teachers, we should never underestimate the power of our actions in words or in deeds. For with one small gesture, we can change a person's life for worse or for better. My experience as a principal in Mayflower Primary School has also been equally fulfilling, and I realize that the most important or the most influential person in the school is not the principal, but the teacher that stands every day in front of the 40 pupils. Through my work in education, I had the opportunity to work with people from diverse socio-economic uh, background to understand their dreams, their aspiration uh, as an individual and as Singaporeans. My community involvement were mostly related in the field of education. I had served in a Muslim orphanage as part of the education uh, sub-committee. Working with these children, I realized Despite the tremendous of support that we have given them, nothing could actually beat the parental love they so dearly miss. I've also helped out uh, in the joint madrasa education, uh, being part of the education uh, resource uh, panel. I only started my grassroots work uh, recently after my resignation from uh, civil service. It has been quite an eye-opener, and I am humbled by the passion and dedication shown by the grassroots leaders. I realize behind every improvement project in an estate is a tremendous amount of quiet work, listening, explaining, meeting objection, and solving problems. It has been a long journey, and I did a lot of self-reflection before I decided to join politics. I've spoken to my friends, my colleagues, and many of them without exception have encouraged and affirmed that I would be able to serve the people well should I decide to choose this path. When I was a principal in Mayflower Primary School, my staff and myself, we wanted our children to be exemplary citizens. And we set out to inculcate the core value of willingness to lead and serve. I think the time has come for me to walk the talk and I hope I could inspire my students to do likewise and serve the country when the time uh, comes. I joined politics as a personal calling. If my late mother had been here, I think I would have received her full blessings. If elected, I would strive my very best to serve the people together with my other fellow PLP colleagues. Arwah ibu saya pernah berpesan, bila seseorang itu dibeli, diberi tanggungjawab, ia adalah amanah daripada Allah. Dan tanggungjawab ini mestilah dilaksanakan dengan ikhlas. 
Saya telah berpegang kepada pesan arwah ibu saya dan segala tanggungjawab yang diberi kepada saya sebagai bapa, sebagai suami dan juga sebagai pendidik, saya telah dapat melaksanakannya dengan baik. Kalau saya dipilih rakyat untuk menjadi ahli parlimen, saya sedar juga yang saya diharapkan dapat memainkan peranan yang lebih dalam membantu dan meningkatkan prestasi masyarakat Melayu Islam. Saya berpendapat bahawa masyarakat kita telah banyak membuat kemajuan tetapi masih ada lagi banyak tetapi masih adalah tetapi masih banyak lagi yang perlu dilakukan untuk kita meningkatkan prestasi masyarakat Melayu Islam. Saya yakin jika kita dapat meningkatkan pendidikan anak-anak Melayu Islam selagi gus kita akan dapat membantu mengatasi masalah pekerjaan yang dihadapi oleh setengah-setengah keluarga Melayu Islam yang menghadapi masalah mendapat pekerjaan yang baik kerana kurang pendidikan atau kemahiran. Saya akan menawarkan pengalaman saya dan juga kerja saya di Union kepada badan-badan bantu diri Melayu Islam untuk bekerjasama dalam usaha membantu masyarakat kita. Terima kasih. Thank you. Sesi.